Hey, Tuesday, March 31st, another at-home workout today. We've got a 15-minute EMOM, so every minute on the minute, we're looking to do about 50 seconds of work and transition in the 10 seconds between movements. Our movements today are, if you've got a jump rope at home, you're gonna be doing double unders. If not, you've got air squats. Also, if you're in our body weight bracket, this is a great opportunity to get a lot of air squats in and a lot of volume. Second movement is gonna be lunges. So ideally we're doing the, those with the backpack. You can throw it on your back in the front rack or we're doing a body weight if you wanna just stick with that. And then lastly, a plank rotation, which we're gonna show you what that is. Our goal for today is we wanna match our reps through all five rounds. So we wanna be getting a consistent number of reps. So try to push it a little bit on that round one and then challenge yourself to match on two through five. Uh, like I said, we wanna be working for 50 seconds every minute and just use those 10 seconds to transition. First minute is double unders or air squats. So with double unders, we're looking to keep our hands nice and close to our body, a good hollow position, and then just bouncing off the balls of our feet, getting the rope under twice with every jump. So he's keeping a nice straight body position, all the rotation in the wrist. If you're not doing jump ropes today, then we're gonna go ahead for air squats or if you wanna get some of that body weight volume up. So we're gonna get all the way down, hips below parallel, and then stand all the way up, making sure that we fully open our hips back up with a nice tall chest through the whole movement and weight through the whole middle of your foot. We're not rocking back and forth. Second is the lunges. So if you've got a backpack, you can go ahead and throw it on your back. If you've got a duffel bag or a plate or a kettlebell, we're gonna go up in the front rack position. And you can either go forward or backward, whatever's more comfortable for you. But either way, we're looking for a light tap on the floor with the knee, we're not crashing down. And then we're driving off of that front foot to stand back up. Once again, keeping a nice tall chest. And relax. Last is those plank rotations. So this is a little bit of a new movement for a lot of you guys. We're gonna start out in a push-up plank position. Again, he's keeping his, a nice straight line. Everything's engaged. So from here, he's gonna lower down to his elbows on his forearms and then push back up to that plank position. Rotating through that for the full 50 seconds. You can relax. So let's try to match all five rounds. Keep working for 50 seconds. Have a good workout.